Hey everybody, Ogre here again for Ogre Breaks, doing a little pack opening. I have six of the value packs of 2024 Tops Series 1 Baseball. Uh, I kind of have a feeling like these might be... I don't know, I'm, I'm going in before I even open it, but usually these aren't really the best versions to open. You know, you get a lot of base, you usually get like two stars of MLB, and then maybe an insert or two if you're lucky or parallel. Um... So I, I don't know. Uh, these are like $8 at Walmart. Uh, they might be $7 at Target. Usually Target's like a dollar cheaper uh, per pack. But I usually at least open up a couple of these just to uh, to open them anyway. Um, I don't know. We'll see what we get, though. Um, the Hager boxes we did an opening of uh, earlier were pretty good. The Mega Box was okay, in my opinion. Um could have been better but also could have been worse um but i don't know we'll see uh so we got uh midros to start us off we got alonzo bobby witt rosarena we got jacob amaya cano castro bailey keller ramirez hartwig julio dubon donovan then we got nick robertson Dansby Swanson, Elias Diaz, Michael Walker, Sal Freelich, Ryan Nelson, Logan Webb, Johan Rojas, rookie card. I think that's actually the first rookie of his that I pulled this year. Uh, Jake Rogers, J.P. Crawford, and then we got a Chrome, stars of MLB, Jazz Chisholm. I'll gladly take that. Uh, Luis Robert, and then we got Julio and Corbin Carroll. You can definitely tell there's a correlation with these. Um, actually, it'd be kind of funny if they were actually, no, but not they're not in correlation with the card number, but uh, there's definitely a cor correlation worth that because I, I know I've pulled that combo between like hangers and other. Uh, I've opened up, I think, at, like two value packs also too off camera. Um, but you can tell that they uh, they uh, are pretty much back to back. So, but uh, we got the Ellie checklist card, uh, Duran Marte, and then league leaders for that was run bad runs batted in. So, but the Lou Bob. 89, the Chisholm uh, Chrome, which, I don't know, I always mean to kind of put this set together, the Chrome version at least, and then I kind of forget about it, um, but it's all right. So let's see what we got next one, next pack. We got Dominic Canzone, uh, we got Corbin Carroll, looks like we got a gold coming up in this one, Taylor, Nathaniel Lau, and then we got Alonzo, Witt, Rosarena, a couple of duplicates for sure. Um, Astros No-No, Shane Bieber, Vito, Yuri Perez, Future Stars. I do like how they put that Future Stars up there, honestly. We got Rogers, Ribe, Griffin Canning, Freeman, Lau, Hamilton, Trout, Valdez, and Connor Joe is the gold to 2024. And then we got Lazardo. And that is, I believe, a case hit. Lazardo, uh, team color. I think these. I'm pretty confident these are case hits. I could be mistaken on that. I know they're. I know they're definitely tough to pull. But uh, Lazardo, uh, uh, team color. Where basically what it is is instead of the white, they got the logo of the team going all throughout. Which I think. I, I think those cards are actually pretty sharp looking, in my opinion. So, all right. Not too bad there. I'll definitely take that. Lazardo had a pretty good year last year. I know he's um, been kind of bumped around in like trade trade rumors because um, his stock's pretty high from the season he had last year. But uh, we got Sal Frelick and Lubob, stars of MLB. Grand Gamers, Johnny Bench. I mean, this insert's okay. It's not really my favorite. Lane Thomas, Tigers, Freed, Woodruff, uh, Stone Garrett, Mar uh, Marlo, excuse me, Arcia, and then Yelich to finish that off. So, all right, not too, too horrible. Definitely not going to complain about getting uh, one of those uh, team color cards. I'm pretty sure, at least in hobby boxes, they're definitely a case hit. Um, I'm not too sure with some of the retail how their case hits, you know, quote unquote, work out. But uh, we got Alec Marsh, Vado, Wheeler, Gabriel Moreno, Future Stars. Uh, Chris Bryant, Hassan Kim, Jordan Westberg, rookie, Ranger Suarez, Logan O'Hoppy, Future Stars, James Tyon, Shea Langoliers, 
Uh, MLB elites of the game, Otani and Betts. Uh, Scooball, Telez, Luis Matos, Andy Abanez, Rizzo. Uh, we got what? Wins leader. Braves team card, Wells, Kirloff, Patrick Corbin, Davis Snyder, Evan Longoria. And then, all right, we got the Chrome, Corbin Carroll. And then we got a Tatis blue plant. Blueprint, excuse me, I can't speak. Uh, Corbin Carroll Chrome, so I'm doing pretty good with pulling these Chromes so far. With uh, I think this might be the sixth different one that I've pulled, and I haven't really opened up a ton of products so far. But Tatis Blueprint insert, I do like those. And then we got Julio and Corbin Carroll, just to kind of prove that point that I did mention earlier. Granted, yes, two very good players to pull, but I don't know, there's a part of me where would like to see a little bit of variety in that. I know it's only a 30-card checklist, so. Uh, Jose Furman. We got Harper. Michael Massey. Uh, Aaron Savali. Spencer Hortz. Judge McCormick. And Miles Mikolas. So, all right. So far, I mean, realistically, not too bad, in my opinion. It would be nice if maybe we get an autograph out of here. But we got ben Bethancourt. Brennan White, Thomas, Muncy, DeGrom, Alec Marsh, Vado, Zach Wheeler, Moreno again, Ben Attendi, Suarez, Ohapi, Tylon, Langoliers, MLB Elites of the Game, uh, Scooball, excuse me, uh, Tellez, uh, Lubob, Brent Rooker. Every time you get the sideway cards, it like you know, it makes you want to think you get like a black parallel. Even though I think the black parallels are hobby exclusive, if I'm not, not mistaken, but kind of teases you a little bit uh, with the way the uh, the border is this year with the the white to black, which I do like the look of it though. Jake Fraley, Cabrian Hayes, Riley Green, Future Stars, Stephen Kwan. Then we got Tyler Glass now, just a regular rainbow foil, uh, which is perfectly fine we got trey turner on the 89 we got vladdy jr and then goldschmidt on the stars of mlb uh horitz judge mccormick Nicholas, keaton win vaughn and alec bohm and then new york power ale sluggers keep lineup stronger so all right let's see what we get these last two packs we got Ruiz, Aquila Williams, we got Murphy, Devin Williams, CJ Abrams, Nick Gonzalez. Would be nice if we could at least get a base Ellie too. Olsen, De not the De La Cruz I was looking for. Uh, Kevin Gossman, Jonathan India, Bryson Stott. Then we got uh, Grayson Rodriguez, Future Stars, Josh Naylor, Tatis, Luciano, Matt Manning, Jeffers, Mountcastle, Contreras, Finnegan, Barola, Barola, excuse me, Jansen, Edwin Diaz. Then we got a Juan Soto to $4.99. Okay, that's a decent one. Green parallel there. And then we got a Riley Green. All right, I'll take a rainbow foil Riley Green, second year card. And then the Juan Soto to $4.99. Definitely can't complain about that either. So 474 out of 499. It's not too bad. Then we got Devers on the 89. We got Incarcion Strand and Bobby Witt. I think these are the first I've pulled of these two out of these stars of MLB. I know the Witt for sure. I'm not sure if I pulled the Incarcion Strand yet, but might have. We got Jake Fraley, Cabrian Hayes, Riley Green, Future Stars, Stephen Kwan, G. Wan Bay, Jason Dominguez. Torkelson and Jake Berger. So at least we got one Dominguez. Definitely striking out too on a lot of the rookies. Um, no Evan Carters yet. Uh, we did get in Custion Strand. Uh, base card at least. But all right, let's see what we get last pack. Like I said, these, these are probably not going to be quite the move in my opinion. I do like the hanger boxes though, where you have those yellow parallels that are exclusive to the hanger boxes. If there's maybe like an exclusive to this, then I might be more enticed to want to open up more of this, but, uh, or at least of these packs, but I, I'm sure, you know, if I walk into a store, I'll probably grab a pack or two. Henry Davis. There we go. And then we got a soda scrum, just a couple of cards earlier. 
um, League of Leaders, Castillo, Joe Jock, uh, which that's a kind of cool photo with the rain in the background. Uh, Vladdy, Singer, Glass now, Samad Taylor. Then we got Zach Gallon, Bristol Gratterall, excuse me, Avaldi, Jose Ferra, Mickey Moniak, Walker Bueller, Dolores Garcia, Brandon Walter, Manuel Valdez, and holy cow, we got an auto. Uh, Matt Williams, that's a decent name. I'm not going to complain about that for sure. Uh, and it is numbered to 199, 60 out of 199. So, uh, maybe I might, maybe I need to bite my tongue on these, um, these packs, or maybe I'm just getting extremely lucky. But Matt Williams, not bad. A uh, player that I always liked growing up. Um, I can remember him, Giants and D backs, uh, best that I can remember off the top of my head. He may have played somewhere else, but it's just slipping, slipping, uh, my mind at the moment, but we got the Verlander on the 89. We got Betts and Pete Crow Armstrong. Still sad to see that the uh, Mets traded him away, but PCA uh, and that Javi Baez deal for having Baez for about a half a season. Uh, Keaton Wynn, Vaughn, Alec Bohm, uh, Yankees team card, Ramirez, O'Neill Cruz, Bobby Miller, future stars, and then Justin Lawrence to finish off. So, I don't know, maybe I need to bite my tongue a little bit on these, because getting an auto, getting a uh, team color uh, parallel as well, can't really complain there. We didn't, we, we struck out on a lot of the base rookies, uh, no Ellie's, no Carters, which that's fine, I, that's, not a, that's not the end of the world. Um, you know, you have, a 300, you have a 350 card checklist, you got 36 cards per pack with the inserts, so that means you'll probably get 30 cards so realistically you have like a one in 10 chance to pull an ellie um you know base card at least i mean you can obviously pull inserts or uh parallels or you know the stars of mlb of ellie as well but um overall though like i said pretty happy with these packs uh lizardo uh team color uh which i actually think these are pretty cool looking parallels um you know stars of mlb chrome corbin carroll nothing too too crazy but you know, rookie of the year last year, but Matt Williams auto, not going to complain about that at all. So, uh, number to 199, which is even nice too. So, but anyway, if you liked the video, appreciate guys. If you leave a like on it, leave any comments on it. Appreciate all the love that I've been getting on the hanger box video. Um, as I recorded this, I haven't posted my mega box video, but you know, hopefully you guys, you know, give that some love as well. Um, but uh, overall, I'm enjoying Top Series 1 so far. Uh, we'll definitely be opening up a lot more of this on the channel. We'll be doing some breaks as well. So if you're ever looking to get into any of my breaks and if you're interested in it, um, just follow me on Instagram. That is where I post my breaks. And with that, I want to thank you guys again for watching. And uh, like I said, if you're new to the channel, greatly appreciate it. Subscribe, hit that notification bell. And with that, thanks again, guys. Take care, everybody.